हाई एवरी वन वेलकम टू योर पीडिया आज इस वीडियो में हमने एन पी सी ए एल अप्लीकेशन डिटेल्ड अप्लीकेशन कैसे फिल करना है वो हम लर्न करेंगे सी वी आर गोइंग टू सी द डिटेल्ड अप्लीकेशन फॉर्म फिलिंग फॉर एन पी सी एल एन पी सी एल रिलीज इट्स नोटिफिकेशन राइट एंड दे आर कॉलिंग इन वन इज टू ट्वेल्व रेशियो राइट सो बिफोर वी प्रोसीड फर्दर subscribe this channel for more this kind of updates and videos very useful information for you right so before i enter into the video i need to give you three points one is npcl is calling in 1 is to 2 ratio second point is they are taking gate 2023 2024 2025 gate score also they are considering all these three gate scores and interview is the final selection your gate score is not having any use once you are shortlisted for the interview just uh, your gate score uh, will give you the entry path up to the interview but your final selection is going to be completely based on your interview performance these are very very important things right see uh, just go to npcl website and there uh, there there will be some uh, on the right corner you will find a register registration for doing the registration the following things are required one is your gate score scorecard i can say in the scorecard everything will be present your gate registration number and all and two important things are the mobile number what you given for the gate and the email id what you given for the gate these two things are very very important people will miss that so you have to give same mobile number and same mail id what you given for gate why because it is asking that way only see the very first page first register then apply once you register you will get one link to your mail id okay open that then you can apply right let us see all the fields advertisement if you want to download the advertisement you can download it post applied for executive training for all of us first post applied for is executive training and the discipline is civil i am taking for example if you are from electrical you can take electrical electronics mechanical whatever it is category unreserved obc sc st these are the possibilities depending upon your category you must have certificate if you are obc non creamy layer then you must have certificate right then only you can take obc otherwise you you come under unreserved only right next are you a person with benchmark disability if you have disability certificate then only you put s otherwise it is no right next see here the details gate details very clearly mentioned gate year i taken 2024 gate registration number your gate uh, roll number in fact gate registered mail email and gate registered mobile yes both are gate registered one only right next uh, name as in the gate form gate application form yes means uh, your name also you must give as that is there in the gate application form not different name right next personal details first name middle name last name gender yes after that date of birth nationality aadhar number these are the very basic details after this after this once you fill these details once you fill these details yes you are going to get this one okay you must give some username that is your wish but your username must contain at least one digit one number one special character like uh, at the rate or dollar or underscore and one capital letter remaining small letters capital letters whatever you want to you can take you can take right password also will carry similar kind of instructions right confirm password email here the mail whatever you are giving may or may not be same as that of your gate mail id you can give different mail id here but make sure that this mail whatever you are giving here that is under working condition but because you are going to get registration link to this email right then mobile number yes you must enter your mobile number here right this mobile number also need not to be same as that of your gate mobile number you can give different mobile number here but make sure that this mobile number is working right then uh, this captcha you need to enter uh, in this box uh, enter the captcha shown in the image in this here there is a box in that you, you need to image Uh, you must enter then you click on the register if you click on the register you will get a link to your mail right now if you click on that link then it will enter this way yes it is going to give this way yes what are the qualifications and all right just a minute yeah 
it will ask for your qualification yes qualification details as on 34 2025 right qualification details as on 34 2025 it is asking for your qualifications right once you register you'll get a link to your mail id click on the link then this will open ssc yes it's 10th class your institute name or your school name then which board it comes under state board or central board or icsc cbs there are lots of boards you can take that name then here this is very important where people will get confused month or year of enrollment first row is month second row is year suppose you joined your 10th class in the month of june on 7th june 7th date of enrollment right here 7 uh, sorry june 7 uh, 7 uh, june 2013 june 2013 date is not required month and year so in the month of uh, june you joined therefore this will be 7 this is 2013 you completed your 10th class uh, by march of 2014 yes you put here march 2014 march means third month what is the aggregate you got in the same way hsc higher secondary means your intermediate but you are a diploma candidate there is option there here right if you are a diploma choose diploma if you are hsc you can take it as hsc right and graduation is there post graduation is also there all those things are of similar your month of enrollment year of enrollment month of completion year of completion and your aggregate marks your aggregate marks right once you do that once you do that you get this after that just below to that qualification on 34 2025 just below to that you will find this what are the level of computer literacy means he's asking what are the different computer skills you have ms word ms excel ms powerpoint ms access email management internet operations if you have any other computer skills also agar aap aap aapke aur kuch computer skills hai then you can put here in this box right then then other qualifications some people may have some extra qualifications if those qualifications are valid and it, you have certificates and you can fill any other extra qualifications you have then you have to go for save and proceed for the next step proceed to the next step right the next step is post work experience means after your graduation or diploma or intermediate some people work and there's then after that they study after otherwise uh, you completed your uh, bachelor's in uh, 2020 since 2020 you are working in some company so those details you need to enter here and uh, uh, calculate experience automatically it will calculate right next if you have more uh, experiences you can add a row also add a new row sir i have a lot of experience i have i worked for four organizations but it is having only three rows or two rows you need not to bother you can add a new row there right then total experience it will calculate save and proceed to the next step right the next step is very a simple thing that is your complete personal details that is uh, mother name father name mother name and uh, marital status religion mother tongue state and are you registered with an uh, employment exchange if s s if not no then uh, address address click this box if your permanent address and correspondent address both are same fill the address once address all those things are done then it will it will ask you an option it will give you an option save and go to the next step yes if you go to that the next thing is uploading your photo and signature here the very important thing is your photo and signature must have some specific size that fellow mentioned for photograph as uh, your photo must be from 10 kb to 50 kb and pixels also he mentioned so according to that uh, uh, size only you need to upload otherwise uh, otherwise website will not take once you do these two things then it will go for payment i am not showing the payment thing here because i did not done the payment just uh, for the sample purpose i taken this one to explain you right you can do the payment by upi or uh, by credit card or debit card or online banking once you do the payment you can get the print of the application entire print of application these are the very simple steps of doing your npcl application if you have any queries uh, with respect to your npcl application form filling you can contact us Europedia is the largest and only the platform which provides a, a, a guidance for interview preparation, right? It is only the platform. Europedia started its mentoring for this 2025 NPCL interview preparation for all branches. 
yes you can join your hands with your pdr to uh, accelerate your preparation towards your npcl interview preparation thank you subscribe for more this kind of information